Hello, everybody. We are here at the 2016 Morongo Pow Wow, and I have a very special guest, Miss Indian World. It's her first time here at Morongo, right? That's right. This is, like, so fun, though, so far. Morongo is awesome. And so what do you think of uh, California and their Pow Wow's Beautiful weather up here. Yeah, a little, little different, but it's really fun. It's really lively, so I like it. Yeah. And so last time we talked, you had just been crowned. How's your year going so far? So far, so good. It's about five months in, and I've been, I've been traveling everywhere. I've hit a lot of nations, a lot of different countries, so i am really, like, been on the road. Highlights so far? Highlight, uh, going to London, uh, visiting uh, Pocahontas, Mato Matawaka's grave, her burial, um, and going to Ireland to see the Choctaw Memorial and getting to be a part of what's going on in Standing Rock, which is my home reservation. And shout out to everybody who's helping with Standing Rock. Thank you. Yeah, and we they just did a big special here at Morongo for Standing Rock. To everybody who's listening out there, maybe who, who didn't see it just now live, what can we do to help? And, and you know, if you want to give everybody a quick update on what's going on. Yeah, so right now uh, there's a pipeline going to be built from my reservation's border less than a mile away. And it's going to go right through our primary water source, our only water source, which is the Missouri River. And uh, if the pipeline breaks, which all pipelines break, uh, it's going to only give us two minutes, le two minutes or less of reactionary time in order to shut our water intake valve off in order so we won't get poisoned from the water, um, from the oil in the water. And so right now um, the federal circuit judge denied the injunction that we had against the uh, Dakota Access Pipeline, and so now we're kind of just on a standstill, and we're waiting for um, the three three federal agencies to do a, a proper review of what's going on, whether they're going after our sacred sites or where they've been kind of constructing everything. So that we're kind of playing the waiting game, but right now everyone's at the Sacred Stone Camp. There was uh, 8,300 people there um, on the day of the injunction, so it's a really big number, and that's when I was there. And um, But right now you can go to sacredstonecamp.org or standingrock.org in order to donate, and uh, yeah, or respectourwater.com or on Facebook, and they have like tons of updates of what you can do. So um, there's a, you can give, you can donate clothes, food, water, money, anything you want, your time, go out there and spend some time. It's really awesome, peaceful camp, uh, full of dances, you get to learn culture, you get to meet people from all over the world, so uh, super exciting. Yeah, I'm, I'm hoping I get to make it out there. Um, I saw uh, we had somebody go up there and do some interviews for us, and they you know, were saying, over here there was some bird dancing, and over here on another corner there's gourd dancing. It's a little bit of everything. It's, it's, it's pretty amazing what's going on up there. Um, and for everybody out there, if you can't donate, um, spread the word on social media. That helps, too. Get the word out. What's going on? All right. So what else you got planned for your year? You, you're, we're, we're... Yeah, so I'll finish my law degree. I'll get a Juris Doctor degree this December, but I'm going to be traveling um, all over. So it just depends. But I try to make it home as back as often as possible. But I will be all over. Um, hopefully try to make it to, like, Hawaii or Alaska would be really cool. So I'm trying to make it up there. We'll see. But for now, I'm hitting the Pow Wow Trail. Kind of keep going from there. So, yeah. All right. Thanks for, thanks for uh, coming on. Thanks, everybody.